What's up guys, my name's Alex, and welcome to another Let's Talk where I talk about all things queer that have interested me in the past week. Let's get into this. So, the first thing that I want to talk about is something that has been recommended to me so much. And honestly, a lot of you guys, I recommend checking out my Instagram because I have posted a video about them a little while ago. Instagram is a place where I just chuck up, like, clips from shows that I'm, like, watching, like, sort of my favourite clips and stuff like that. Um, yeah, so if you guys ha aren't following my Instagram, you guys should definitely do that because, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so I've been recommended this couple by so many people. And the couple is Chris and Joanna from the show Scam Spain? Scam? Is that right? I think it's right. I'd seen this show a bit, so Scam Spain is on its second season right now which is where the couple is. Um, but this show, I believe it's like a Spain variation of like, I don't know where the original one originated from, but it's had a lot of variations, this show Scam. Like I said, they're up to their second season. I haven't watched their first season. I am just watching like the clips of the couple. I'm not actually watching like the whole thing. But the show is has got like a really interesting format. Like, so they upload clips during the week as the events happen. So like, say there's a party they go to on a Friday night, they'll upload the clip on the Friday night that actually happens. So it's like telling a story in real time, which is really, really fascinating. And then they put all the clips together um, and put out like sort of the whole episode at the end of the week. But anyway, so we're talking about Chris and Joanna and oh, man. So we're on to our third week of the, of season two and they haven't got together yet, but oh my God. <sighs> There is a lot of chemistry, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I I am getting really, I'm fully getting on board with these two because, oh my god, like I don't, oh, I swear to god, whenever they're like next to each other, they can't help but just like look at each other's lips. I like, I swear to god, they can't help themselves but to look at each other's lips all the freaking time. But yeah, like I said, they haven't got together yet. I'm hoping soon. Uh, a little bit of spoilers. It was just sort of revealed not too long ago that Joanna has a boyfriend. Which I was not expecting because she has seemed to be the one that's sort of like been pursuing Chris a bit more than Chris Joanna, if that makes sense. So, oh man. There's already so much drama going on and I am just so here for this. I am so here for the pining, for the angst, for the heart eyes, oh, the ship. It seems to have it all. It seems to have it all. So I would recommend checking it out. For those of you that are wondering where you can watch the clips, um, you can watch them on YouTube. So the actual like official network, they upload the clips on on their YouTube channel. Um, and after a while, people submit um, closed captions, I believe. So, you know, sometimes it's like 20 minutes after the clips uploaded and you've got English subtitles. Um, sometimes it's a couple hours, but I'll have a link to their YouTube channel in the description. Um, yeah, so I've been watching them there. I believe like the characters have their own like social media accounts, like Instagram accounts. I'm following them, but also like a lot of it is in Spanish and <laughs> I don't know Spanish <laughs> and obviously they're not subtitled there. So, I mean, yeah, you, you can go adventuring into the social media side of that, but I'm not really taking in too much of that just because like there's not a whole lot that's translated. Um, but yeah, I will have a link to the, the YouTube channel where you guys can go check out all the clips as they're uploaded. Um, yeah. <laughs> I was thinking about doing sort of like weekly review videos like I used to do with Neighbours when it was, you know, decent. It seemed like it was going somewhere. Um, we're not talking about Neighbours, so. Uh, yeah, so I was thinking like, you know, they upload the episode on like the full sort of episode on the Sundays and I'm thinking maybe I could do like a weekly review slash wrap up of the clips um, on a Sunday as well. Yeah, let me know if you guys would be keen for that. Also, I'm kind of, I'm throwing up in the air whether I should do reaction videos to this couple because I'm loving them and I haven't previously done like reaction videos on like soap operas, like things that happen like daily because like there's just so much content, like with Neighbours or with whatever it is, I haven't 
done reactions because they're it's like a full 20 minute episode every single day but with this show it's like two or three minute clips you know maybe every couple days or sometimes they're you know day after day but they're only two or three minute clips so i'm thinking maybe i can just do reaction videos to those two or three minute clips during the week as well I don't know. It, yeah, it's an idea that I'm tossing up in my head. So I'm going to have a poll. I've never done a poll on YouTube before. I'm going to put a poll up. Um, and I would like to, I would like for you guys to vote. If you guys would like to see reaction videos, um, they will be going up on my Patreon, like all my reaction videos. Um, but yeah, check out the poll, vote. And yeah, we'll see where that goes. <laughs> But moving on from that, I want to talk about You, Me, Her. I haven't talked about You, Me, Her in a little while. It is back. Uh, first episode premiered this week. I'm um, not going to lie. I think the last season I was a bit disappointed with just because it felt like they kept on like doing the same drama over and over and over again. Like two of them would like get really close and then the other one would get really, really jealous. And then they all make up and then two of them would get really close and the other one would get really, really jealous. It just... It felt like that's all that happened for like the last two seasons. My the, like season one, incredible. Season two, I was like, okay, there's a bit of drama here, but it's fine. But then when they just kept on like hammering on that drama in season three, I was getting a little frustrated, not gonna lie. But season four premiered this week. I am hoping it's a good season. I'm hoping they don't go down that whole jelly sea route again and again and again. <laughs> It does seem like I think they are moving past that, potentially. Um, we've got some baby drama this season, which is going to be interesting to watch. So I'm definitely checking out You, Me, Her. It's a, like I said, first season I absolutely freaking loved. Um, and I believe the th all three seasons, obviously not number four, but I think all three seasons are up on Netflix. So you guys can go binge watch it if you haven't yet. Um... But yeah, I am excited for season four. I really do hope it's good. Um, and I'm excited to see what they bring. Next thing that I want to talk about is Klexicon. I just want to quickly talk about it in case you guys didn't know. But I feel like if you're on social media, you'll know. Klexicon is happening this weekend. I am so freaking jealous of everyone that is going. I've just been watching all these people like posting about how they're arriving in Vegas. And oh my god. It's just bringing back so many feels. I wish I was back in Vegas. Last year was incredible. I wish I was in Vegas this year for Klexicon. It makes me so sad that I'm not. <laughs> but I will be keeping my eyes on everything that happens this weekend at Klexicon. But yeah, I did just want to give you guys a heads up in case it had slipped your mind. Um, but yeah, so you guys can keep an eye on social media like myself for all things Klexicon. Um, I don't know if they're streaming the panels this year. I think they did last year, like the main events. I'm not sure if they're doing that again this year. Um, but yeah, I check out, check out my social medias. If you guys aren't following me on either Twitter or Instagram, I do recommend it because I talk about a lot of stuff that maybe I don't get to at my Les Talks or whatever. Um, or, you know, I, I talk about it before I make the video. So I would recommend following both because like I said at the start of the video, there are things that I post on Instagram that I don't necessarily post on Twitter and vice versa. So follow me on both. Links are in the description. <laughs> yeah, I'm excited to watch uh, the happenings of ClexCon this year. And the last thing that I want to talk about is Proven Innocent. I think I've talked about Proven Innocent before. Um, I loved it. I am loving it. I am excited about Madeline um, and her storyline. She had a great sort of storyline this episode. Well, they had a great storyline, like as an overall storyline. They focused on uh, trans rights and all that sort of stuff. Um, very powerful episode. I would definitely recommend checking it out. Like, if you haven't watched Proven Innocent to begin with, I do recommend watching the show. It's on its first season. I think we're a few, six episodes in, seven episodes in. Definitely go check it out. It's a good watch. Love Madeline. She came out at the end of, well, at the end of the episode, she rang her mom and she was like, I'm dating woman and I'm bi. <laughs> um, and I love her. I, I am curious slash just like anxiously waiting for like the reveal of her being like when she was younger, being in love with her best friend. I'm just waiting for that, to be honest. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's a good show. It, I, I do highly recommend it. Um, last episode was really, really good. And 
yeah, it, I just feel like no one is talking about it. Um, so I did want to talk about it again. Point you guys in its direction. Proven Innocent. Great show. Great watch. Go watch it. <laughs> but I think that's about it from me today. I hope you guys like this video. I want to give a big shout out to my Patreon sponsors. We got Marissa, Corey, and Kathy. You guys are incredible and help me do what I do. If you like this video, hit that like button and subscribe if you're new. I will see you guys in my next video. Okay, bye.